Hello guys and welcome back here with Denver on ITN Autos and today I'll tell you how to install GSI and Jabs on Realme 3 Pro. So first you need to boot your phone into recovery by holding volume down and power like this. Now select recovery using volume button that and press the power button to OK. Show the screen that now let's just format that first before installing anything. Let's go back. Now let's install. The zip. Okay, so GSI is actually uh, IMG files normally. And sometimes it's actually a zip, but it's not a flashable zip, but it's actually a compressed IMG file, so you need to extract it first. Now I already have it in my SD card, so I have actually that much ROM. First, I'll show you uh, how to install any GSI except for Oxygen OS, because installing Oxygen OS GSI is a little bit weird. You can see Part Three A for that. Now let's try um, maybe AOS IP. Now make sure you flash it in system image. Don't get it wrong. It must be in system image. That flash it. And it will take maybe around two three minutes. Now after the phone shows image flash completed, uh, that blue writing unlocks. Tap back. Now let's hmm. Flash Permissiver, I'll also link that down below. Permissiver should be in zip, so make sure press install zip and install image like that. Now, if it shows install image, means that you're on zip mode, okay? And if you're on zip, like this, it's, it means that you are in image mode. Okay, now we're back to zip then you should see here kernel underscore permissive underscore patcher dot zip this is the right file and flash it now at this point you have a gsi but you don't have any uh, google services in your phone so how to install services first you can go back go home to the you know the main screen of Prep. Now you tap wipe, advanced wipe, repair or change file system. Oh, make sure to check system first. Yeah. Now resize file system like that. If it fails, try it one more time. It sometimes works. And if it still fails like this, means that you need to boot the system first. Let the system boot once and redo what I did just now and should be successful. Please note that after a GSI boot, sometimes the touchscreen didn't work for a while, so you need to re lock the phone like that. Wait for around maybe 5 seconds, then open the phone again, then the touch should work. Okay, now let's install the Google services by shutting it down first. Rebooting it to recovery, then flash it. Now, after you booted your phone back to recovery, tap install. Oh, wait, you need to repair first. Repair system. That size. Still face. If it shows error 1, do it one more time. That's a twerp bug. I don't know why. See? Now it's successful. Okay, now let's install gaps. 
I have the caps on my SD card as usual Make sure you downloaded the ARM64 one and it's for Android Pie Now the gaps is installing Just wait for maybe it maybe takes around two to three minutes and you can reboot your device and you're good now after you finally done installing it it shows done and shows successful like that just reboot to system and you'll have all Google surfaces like basic Google surfaces for nano gaps and you'll get Okay, thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, see you in part 4.